Okay, this is not gonna make a lot of sense right now. You guys are asking me, what am I, what am I doing here? I am, um, I moved out of the basement where I was living in my stepdad's house. I did my first internship, it was eight months. I should be going back to school right now in my third year, but instead I'm gonna take the year off. And it's essentially like I'm doing my third year of school, except I'm gonna be teaching myself and I'm gonna be filming it and broadcasting it to YouTube. It's 3 p.m. I gotta, oh, I gotta do laundry. After I get my clothes from downstairs, we are going to work on putting everything into containers. I've never put .NET into containers. So hang fire server, authentication server. That's the goal for today is to finish all the back end. A lot, a lot has happened today. I got this guy to come in and install some cable for me. We have Cat6 in my room here. I just tested it, right? Beauty, beauty. I bought this router, so I'm gonna be able to create my own local network on top of my home network. There's just, there's stuff everywhere. Yeah, I got, I got a lot of work to do here. All I wanna do is make YouTube videos and code, but I need to solve all these problems before I can even get to that point. Another problem, my tripod is broken, so I don't have a tripod. I can't even set up this camera. I would have to put it on something, like a couch. I gotta write this all down. That's another problem. <laughs> Yesterday I put up this whiteboard, which is pretty cool. Look at this. This is all the stuff I need to do. Containerize microservices and Docker images. These two ports are connected directly to our home router's LAN port. Now this is my router. So now I got my network going, which is pretty sick. It's January 3rd, I just invested. <laughs> no, I bought some new equipment and now I just need a tripod. Whoa, it's slippery as fuck. I have no idea which tripod. Let's just hope that this tripod is not too massive. This is so sick. It's been a, it's been a few days since I've done some development. Uh, I'm finally at the point where I can sit down and try to learn Kubernetes. Now that I understand what each tool is used for, and I understand how to put them into Docker images, I just need to orchestrate the container. My, my mind is being blown. And this monitor showed up. Not gonna lie, that is, okay, that is sexy. Last night, I set up the DNS records for our guy here. If you're watching this right now, that means the site is live. I've been coding 24 seven for the past two weeks and I finally got my site, I got the front end connected to the back end and deploying a cluster, a Kubernetes cluster and coding up all the microservices, uh, to, it's taken longer than expected, you know? I haven't been at the university in eight months because I've been working. Now that I finished my work term, I was like, huh, if I take a year off, nothing bad's gonna happen, but I'm able to work on these projects and make videos all day every day and I'm like that sounds like a good deal so that's um that's the plan there's basically a million things I want to learn I've listed them all on my site and I want to teach myself and film it and upload it and I want to do that at least once a week also all my friends are still in university I only live one hour drive so I'm probably gonna be driving back and hanging out with my friends and maybe I can shoot some vlogs because the social environment was just so fun when I was living with my best friends and we were just doing dumb stuff every day and I just filmed it. <laughs> that box 
Rescue mission. Yeah, we did fucking thing. Angelina did it. Yeah, come on. <laughs> yeah, man. The past two weeks have literally just been 24 7 coding. I finally built up the infrastructure of my website. That way, when I have an idea, I can just integrate it into my current technology stack. Okay, I'm out. I'll see you guys in a week or four days, whatever.